Hai yang mana sih? Hai yang mana sih? Kan saja. Biar media. We the participants of Google Science Fair 2012 have designed an autonomous robot named Andy, which has many special features within it. But the most fascinating feature of Andy is the interaction with people. As we said earlier, Andy is an autonomous robot which takes decisions on its own with the help of 8-bit microcontroller which works as a brain. These decisions of microcontroller are programmed with a language called embedded C. Coming to its hardware, it has a microcontroller as its brain, sensors as its input and motors as its output. In this case, sensors are made of IR LEDs which emits IR rays. When an obstacle blocks its way, the IR rays gets reflected. It measures the distance between the obstacle and the robot itself. As Andy can move, it also holds things which is controlled remotely with the help of a radio frequency technology. When the frequencies are sent remotely, the gripper which acts as its finger opens and closes, which indeed holds the object. We have made a software in Microsoft Visual Basic, which works as a serial communication with the computer and the robot. This software has text-to-speech capabilities as well as speech recognition and free talk. Free talk is a part of interaction of Andy which involves human. When a person interrogates Andy, it searches for the specific answer. In case the answer is not found in its software, free talk is then used. As free talk is a special and different feature of Andy, we would be happy to explain more. The user of Andy answers the question through a wireless mic which is then sent to the software using Bluetooth. This answer is then amplified to a robotic voice in the software and then outputs it in the robot using an inbuilt speaker. The speech recognition feature of Andy is done with the help of speech recognition software. There are totally 6 questions. When we ask a specific question among them, it recognizes them and gives the output. In this case, it is the answer. Text-to-speech feature allow you to type text which then converts it to speech as again said outputs it through the robot. Andy has a webcam mounted on its head which is connected to the USB port of the computer. Then the software recognizes the webcam and then enables you to preview, record and save the webcam view. We the programmer and designer of Andy have submitted our project to the Google Science Fair 2012.